Uh, just make sure you guys are having your life jacket as the most outer wear. It's important that we just get the dry reps on land so that we know that we can do it right once we hit the water. We don't want to waste the valuable training time in the water. We're trying to get everything right on land so that the first time we hit the water, we do it right immediately. The whole idea of the crawl, walk, run is take it slow on land. We learn all the basic functions, where everyone needs to be, and then uh, we do that slick first, and then we do it with a little bit more gear, and then, uh, then we do it while we're in water. We were practicing the evacuations in nice still water where it's a lot easier to do, and then getting out of the trash and swimming is roughly 25 to 50 meters within the water. So still a pretty easy swim just to an evacuation boat or to another track. And again, we did that 500 meter surf qualification, giving the Marines a little bit more confidence and getting them out in that deeper water where we'll actually be operating with the tracks when we're moving from sea to land. The Marine Corps is obviously amphibious by nature and it's what we're meant to be doing is moving from ships to the land. And so it's just nice to see that we're getting back to those roots. We went out about 500 meters and we did uh, swim to shore. The culminating event was a uh, shore to shore with the Amtrak. So we went out, rode up the coastline, went to a combat town, and we raided it. We've been in them before on our last deployment. So going back into them, it's like a 180 degree turn.